if Android 17 and 18 are activated, do you think Vegeta will be able to take them out? Hard to say, honestly. Let's just hope he can scrap those two before they're activated. If this Dr. Jiro built a lab in such a remote location, he must not like people very much. He wasn't exactly a well-respected scientist. No surprise there. Android 17 and 18. Hey, hey, this doctor. Feel free to browse. <laughs> Come back real soon. Welcome. Well, are we close to where the lab is? There it is, up ahead. It's over there. It's close. What just happened? You didn't create us. We had lives before you ruined them. Listen to me. You must eliminate Goku's allies. They're coming. That's an order. You hear that? It's an order, Seventeen. We're not going to follow a single one of your orders. We're just going to take care of ourselves now. 
geezer. There's another one! What in the world is going on in there? Let's go! I feel a lot better now. Hey, what's that? Hey, I don't think I've seen you before, big guy. What's your number? 16. Android 16, huh? Interesting. So you're an earlier model. <clears throat> Android 16? I've never heard of an Android 16. Wait, so, so those are the androids that Dr. Giraud was talking about? Trunks, can you confirm that these are the androids you originally warned us about? Y yeah, but uh, I've never seen that large one they called 16 before. What? At least, I haven't seen him in my time. So, what's going on here? <laughs> Who cares? Just one more hunk of scrap to add to the pile I'm going to make. Wait, where's Dr. Giraud? Oh, the old man? I took care of him. <laughs> hmm. All right, let's go. Get going? I'm not crazy. So let's go. Hey, 16. You were created specifically to kill Goku, right? Correct. Well, I guess that settles it then. Where are they going? Tell me they're actually going to try to find Goku. That's what Dr. Jiro wanted, right? To kill Goku! I couldn't give a damn about that! How dare they! How dare they ignore the mighty Vegeta! Kill Kakarot! Ha, don't make me laugh! They're going to pay for not recognizing my power! Well, well, I didn't expect to see you rejects roaming around in here. You're going to tell me where you're going right now, whether you want to or not. We're off to find Goku. We're gonna kill him. See, that's what I thought. Too bad that's not going to happen. Because I'm going to blow every one of you to peace. You Saiyans sure are full of yourselves. Aren't that pride of yours. It's just gonna get you killed faster, you know. You've got quite the mouth on you for a machine. So who's up first? The punk? The woman? Or maybe I should just scrap all three of you trash cans at once! Wait, that's right. We still haven't seen what you can do, 16. Why don't you fight him? Negative. My prime directive is to eliminate only Goku. Wow. What a letdown. Fine. I'll do it then. Vegeta! Are you alright? <laughs> so you came. You're really starting to piss me off. Vegeta and 18 are about to fight. What? Still, just watching isn't much fun. You know what that means. You and I won't be having any interruption. <laughs> be warned. I don't plan on going easy. How do I guess 
you're an android, you're not... Prepare yourself! Don't tell me. That wasn't the best you can do, was it? Of course not. Got a gun! Prepare yourself! Idiot. much in you. Does that mean that that Goku guy is even stronger than you? I'm the stronger one. No matter. It's not like you're a big deal. Don't underestimate me! Believe it! You're done! Maybe I shouldn't admit this, but I'm actually kind of impressed you held out this long. Damn you, woman. Now you've done it. Oh. I think it's time we end this little game. You're about done, right? Don't worry, they're still alive. You'd better hurry up, though. Give them those sensu beans of yours, so should we get going? But aren't we going to ask them the whereabouts of Goku? Nah. It'll be more fun if we have to find him ourselves. Ugh. You can be such a child sometimes, Seventeen. You, you know? think so? Whatever. I'm fine as long as we can make a stop. My clothes are a mess. Sure, why not? Uh, hey, wait! Huh? What is it that you guys are after? I mean, why are you doing this? Well, first, we're gonna take care of Goku. I mean, why are you going after- Hey, this is all just a game. I mean- You probably won't just stop because I asked you to. Negative. We were created for the sole purpose of eliminating Goku. You heard the big guy. Yeah. But shouldn't you be helping your friends instead of talking to us? <laughs> See ya. Bye. I gotta help the others. So they knew all about the sensu being. <laughs> Don't go after him. He'd finally getting beaten. Even trunked. <laughs> okay, here's the plan. Before we do anything... Uh, so... 
foot? Uh, he went that way. Uh, okay. One final trick. So, you know what's in huh? the... That's Kami's place. And? What when is... I was back on planet, he told me. So... Uh, but wait. Uh, Piccolo probably... But what about my fa... I... Relax, there's no need to... I mean... We are Jita's the only one... What? Who... Hey, no need to apologize. I'm going to meet up with Chaozu. If things get hairy again, I'll be back. Gotcha. We're gonna get Goku and take him to Master Roshi's place, okay? Okay. Make sure you tell Goku not to overdo it. Right. We'll tell. Overdo it, huh? <laughs> yeah, of all the times not to overdo it, now would actually be the time. The androids in my timeline were in no way that powerful. Has history really been altered that much? for concern.
Goku's house. Uh, hello. Oh, I thought I heard someone. Krillin, I was hoping Gohan had come back. Trunks, let me introduce Goku's wife. This is Chi Chi. Huh? Who are you? I don't think I've seen you before. Hey, Chi Chi, pleased to meet you. Krillin, yo, oh, Yamcha. How's Goku? Are there any changes? He's fine. He took his medicine, and now he's sleeping. So you're the guy from the future, huh? Oh, yeah. You're the one that beat the androids, right? <laughs> no. 
Sorry, but we'll fill you in later. First, we need to move Goku to Master Roshi's place, and fast! What's going on? Two. Actually, three scary androids are on their way here, and they're after Goku! Oh no, that's not good! All right, it's all packed up. Now we just wait for Gohan. There he is. Huh? What's everyone doing here? Did, did something happen? We'll tell you on the way. Just get in. Come on, tell us. Have any leads just yet? Do you have any idea where Goku is? Didn't you hear me before? It's more fun this way, taking our time and hunting him down. Regardless, we should still have some kind of game plan. Hey, Sixteen, what about you? You know something, right? Goku's house is located in the mountains in East District 439. So you did know something. You're just full of surprises. Did Affirmative. If we fly, we should arrive in a matter of minutes. I know, right? See? This guy gets it. Traveling on foot is a complete waste of time when you're capable of flying. You're such a whiner. <sighs> you know what? You can be a real pain in the neck, Seventeen. We're just about at Master Roshi's place. Hey, Krillin. Yeah? We should probably let Bulma in on everything that's happening, don't you think? Uh, yeah, you're right. So, what does that mean I have to call her? Aw, oh, man. You know, your mom isn't exactly easy to talk to sometimes. <laughs> She's the same in my time, too. Uh, Bulma? It's, uh, it's Krillin. Krillin, you're all right? Why didn't you tell me before? Is my son, uh, my future son, there? Huh? Oh, uh, yeah. Why? What's up? Well, I heard from headquarters that we got a call a few days ago from someone out west in the countryside. They said they found a strange vehicle in the mountains that had Capsule Corporation written on the side of it. I got them to send me a photo, which I then tried to match with a database of our products to see who it might belong to. But it didn't match anything I could find. I thought Trunks might know something about it. It's covered in moss, and it looks really old. Would you mind taking a look for me? I'll send you a pic. Wait, this is... Yeah. It's definitely the time machine I came here in. But how is that possible? I've got my time machine right here with my other capsules. I thought this might be a time machine, but what's it doing in a place like that? Do you know the exact location of the time machine? Well, not the exact location, but I do know that it's somewhere out in West District 1050. You headed there? Yes. I'd like to see it for myself. Then I'm coming too. We can meet up near the machine's location. I'd like to help you look for it too. Is that okay? <gasps> of course. Thank you. Gohan. Don't worry, Mom. 
We're not going anywhere dangerous. We'll be safe. Um... Trunks? Yeah? I, I was wondering... Is... Is the future really all that bad? They look weak. No cause for concern. I'm extremely grateful for this find. Yup! They look weak. No cause for concern. Should be in this area. Let's start looking. Trunks, that's it over there, isn't it? It's a time machine, all right. Yup! I'm low on energy. Trucks, aren't you hungry? Hi, Boma! Hey, you're both here! So this is the time machine you were talking about? Yeah. That's right. Here, I'll take out my time machine. Check it out. This is the time machine I came in. As you can see, it's identical to the other one. But this one looks like it's been here for a really long time. It looks like something made this hole by melting the dome from the inside. Let's take a look inside. What? What's this? Ew! What is it? I... I'm not sure. What's it doing in the time machine? This is... some sort of egg, isn't it? <sighs> What's going on? It's not just this egg that confuses me, though. Huh? 
I looked at the onboard panel and happened to see when this time machine left. What do you mean? Obviously, it's from the same time as you, right? Actually, it's from even further in the future. Three years after I left. Three years? And that's not all. The panel showed that it arrived here four years ago. Uh, uh, so that means this thing arrived here one year before I did. What's going on? I thought the reason the two androids, Goku, and the others fought were then the reason history had changed so much was because of my coming here. But this, it's possible this thing might actually be the cause of all the changes. Uh. Wait, what's that? What's what? Oh, it's just, I was wondering what that is. Some sort of exoskeleton. Gross. An exoskeleton? Is it... I bet. That's what... Right. It... But how did it end up in this time period? Either someone placed the egg in the time machine, or they came here carrying... Uh, uh hey. Yeah. Then, uh, we... You guys are gonna be at Kame House, right? Right, thanks. I... Kami looked down in both amazement, just as Krunks and aware of the- It seems much what Earth needs now. Then... Bio-Android Fiend from the future. I can't believe I'm actually going to see that old prune. I hope you're ready for this, Kami. Kami, I assume you know that I do, Piccolo. Though I am Earth's guardian, I stand powerless before the threat to a- All right, then you're ready to do- Of course, though- After all that's happened, don't- Well, if I am- What? A long time ago, in my ignorance, I allowed evil to take root in my heart. Those who walked the path of darkness, this was demonstrated by her eye to repeat the same mistake after our few the resulting catastrophe would far eclipse the android. <laughs> Skip to the point. Why do you hesitate? Hmm. Well, very well. Answer me this, Piccolo. Is now truly the time for this fusion? What do you mean? Wait. I see you. you I shall ask is now Oh come on. Whatever folks I see. Then allow me once we the Dragon Ball. The Dragon Ball's if I fight it so if we I see very well. It seems my time has come. That's right. Very well. <laughs> I'm going to be the bait. Indeed. Once on You'll learn Got it. Thank you for everything, Mr. Popo. Farewell, Kami. Please, don't die. I am neither Kami nor Piccolo. I am a Namekian who's forgotten his true name. Right. I'm off.
Ginger Tip. This thing that's killing all these people. Who or what could it possibly be? All right, monster. You're in trouble. <laughs> Decided to show your face, monster? <laughs> What's going on? I can sense Goku's energy from this creature. What the hell are you? Oh, you don't need to know that. All you need to know is... <clears throat> like I said, there's no need for you to know. I see. You've got the wrong to mech, believe it or not. And why is that? Because now I don't have to hold back. Guess I'll do this the hard way. Just have to beat the answers out of you. <laughs> You're more than welcome to try. Special beam cut! Look at that. You're not nearly the terrifying monster I thought you were. Impressive. Although I still have yet to achieve my perfect form. Perfect form? Unleash your inner power! Damn it! Unleash your inner power! You're attacking people to achieve your perfect form? Damn it! Special beam cannon! The inevitable! I suppose I'm, I'm an android, you see, and you can call me by my name, Cell. Dr. Giraud created me in a lab on his computer. Huh? Dr. Long ago, Dr. Giraud gathered the genetic material from the strongest fighters in the world, but it took too long, so he abandoned the project. Fortunately, his computer picked up where he left off and continued his research. Cells from Goku, Piccolo, Vegeta, and even Frieza and his father were collected when they arrived on using a tiny bee-sized spy robot. Created, the computer already has enough cells to begin its research. But the process is slow, and it will take 24 years. Impossible. 
We completely destroyed Dr. Giroux's laboratory. The computer is located in an underground facility deep beneath his laboratory. You mean it took you three years after arriving here to go from an egg to... Once I revert to an egg, I must bury myself underground for three years. There my form matures. I see. One final question. I have to know. Why here? Why this? Dr. Giroux's computer informed me that my evolution will morph two different life forms before I achieve perfection. And those two life forms are Android 17 and 18. What? Unfortunately, despite searching far and wide, I had quite a problem locating those pesky androids. It seems they were nowhere to be found in my era. But in a stroke of luck, I learned that Trunks had a time machine. So I used my magnificent skills and abilities to kill Trunks and steal his time machine. Then I used it to travel here to find the android. <laughs> But why this point in history? And Trunks had already programmed the time. I just pressed a switch and the machine did the rest. Oh, I think I'm getting it now. Trunks was able to defeat the androids in his future and program the time machine for this time to come and tell him. That's not all the computer told me. It is said the moment I achieve my perfect form, I will acquire a- Thanks for helping me solve this little mystery. But you're not getting that perfect form- Piccolo! <sighs> Drunks. Ah, he used the time machine. How very clever of him. So, so this is the guy who attacked all those people and- He must be the thing that left the exoskeleton near the time machine. You got that right. I'll fill you in on the details later. First things first, we need to squash this bug. <sighs> now, very well. But know this, Android 17 and 18 will be mine. So fire! <laughs> no! No! Damn, I can't. One of the huge power levels that showed up out of nowhere is gone now. I can't sense it. What? 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 Piccolo? Talk! What the hell happened? Tien's apparently on his way here too. One Tell me one thing first. How did you increase your power so much in such a short period of time? It looks like he fused with Kami. That's all it took? What is it with all these low lives? How dare they attempt to surpass the greatest Super Saiyan in the universe? I can't stand this anymore. Look what you've done, Kakarot. Looks like Tien's here. Good. Uh, I... So, to prevent Cell from achieving his perfect form, we either need to find him and kill or we need to find Android Seven. If you ask me, I'm tired of I don't care who I'm Don't be naive. We could barely You dare under I'll become Beyond Super Saiyan? Is that even possible? Hey, uh why don't we just go back to the lab and destroy Cell before he's finished? Good idea. Let's do that. At the very least, we'll create an alternate future where Cell doesn't exist. Alright. Krillin and Trunks will go on and head back to the lab. Me. Right. Well, if we come up empty, we'll just head back to Kami House. We can check the news for clues. All right. Let's go, Trunks. Thanks. Go beyond Super Saiyan? Is that even possible? Ah! I'm 
guessing we can't just go back into the past and scrap the androids there, right? Right. It's likely that anything we do in that timeline won't affect this one. Man, there's no easy way out of this, huh? Dr. Giroux's computer and cell are down there somewhere. I think this is it. Yeah. So, should we just go ahead? Not yet. We might be able... Ah, right. The... Did it. Right. And now... I didn't think we... If we show these... True. Actually... Huh? You're... No. Not... I thought I'd do some training with my... If he's able... Well, Vegeta's not... You even... may be right. But sparring with... Right. Reading you loud and clear. Thanks. Then, Trunks sought out his father, v impressed. First two, and then three days had passed. Piccolo and the others, using Kame House as their base, continued their hunt for Cell, but to no avail. They could do nothing but watch as news of more victims spread. A monster has made its way to a town in South District 48. Half the residents are gone. Hmm. So he's made his way south. Well, come on! We might still be able to catch him if we leave now. Good luck! That cell creep sure is a force to be reckoned with. Oh, did everyone leave? Go on too? Great so. Go on, please be careful. I hope they're able to find that monster. <sighs> huh? If we approach Cell in this thing, we won't have to worry about him reading our power levels, don't you think? He's a crafty one. Even if we get close, we're still going to have to flush him out. Goku! Yo! How did you get here? Was it that instant transmission thing? Yep. You're back to 100% then? Yeah. But I'm kind of hungry. Hey, Camicolo! <laughs> You don't have to combine our names. I'm mostly Piccolo, so just call me Piccolo. I hate to admit it, but I'm not powerful enough right now to take on the androids and that cell guy. But I think I've got an idea. I'm gonna take Gohan somewhere we can get a year's worth of training in one day. That's right. The hyperbolic time chamber, of course. Wait. No one has ever been able to last an entire year in there. Even you could barely last a whole month before. But things are different than before. We'll be fine. And don't forget, we can bring Vegeta and Trunks along with us. They'll be able to handle it for sure. Then get a move on. Cell's killing more and more people, and his power's growing every minute. Right. Goku, let me ask you something. Are you afraid we might be up against someone scarier than Frieza? Or are you happy about that? Both. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see that you're not giving up. There's that. Go on, let's go. We'll grab Vegeta and Trunks on the way. Okay. Where do you think... Vegeta and Trunks are training. Let's see. 